the rugged North Devon coast, where Exmoor meets the sea. Hiding somewhere between Minehead and Ilfracombe are the twin settlements of Linton at the top of the hill and Lynmouth at the bottom. It's known as England's Little Switzerland, with the bonus of some of England's most stunning coastline, where the Bristol Channel begins to turn into the Atlantic Ocean. With the Valley of Rocks less than a mile down the road, along with the famous National Trust site Watersmeet nearby, this part of the Exmoor National Park is a treasure for walkers, sightseers and those who simply want to get away from it all, amidst the goats and wild ponies that have existed here in Lorna Dune country for decades. On the site of the historic Royal Castle Hotel, once stayed in by King Edward VII when Prince of Wales, now stands the exclusive property Castle Heights. Surrounding it, a beautifully designed and cared for entrance area with ample parking, just yards from Linton and Lynmouth, but more of that in a moment. Available to you is a stunning penthouse suite, with arguably the best views in Devon. The luxuriously furnished sitting and dining room can take up to five people, with facilities such as satellite television, DVD player, along with brochures, local books and holiday hints from other guests. The kitchen is modern, well equipped and meets all the standards required of a superior holiday rental. Three bedrooms are available, a comfortable single room with space to sit and reflect, with a charming view over Linton itself. A beautifully appointed double, again with views looking over quiet houses and cottages and the trees of the National Park. For those two bedrooms, an immaculately designed and spacious shower facility. And the master bedroom, a super king-size bed with modern ensuite shower room. And what about those incomparable views that will make this a holiday to remember and to return to time and time again? From the sitting room, a balcony like no other, where you can settle down with your cup of tea, your paper, and just breathe in Devon. Below you, Lynmouth, where the waters of the East Lynn and the West Lynn meet and flow out to sea. And above that, a view you will never forget. Exmoor, Countersbury Hill, South Wales, the Gower Peninsula. And when you can tear yourself away from the views, just a few hundred yards away, Linton itself. A settlement sought after in Victorian times, which today keeps its Victorian splendour and combines it with a healthy range of shops for tourists and locals alike. Among them, and just a few yards from the property, Lily Mays. A tea shop and informal restaurant, meaning there's really no need to cook at all. Lily Mays is just the beginning of a selection of attractive shops, selling local cider and delicacies, fruit and veg, all at the beginning of this thriving little town. The Church of St Mary the Virgin, dating back to the 13th century, offers a picnic area just yards from Castle Heights with, again, those stunning views. Opposite the church, popular shops like Churchill House, good to browse in and excellent to buy from, walking and rugged fashionable clothing that'll sort you out for many a North Devon walk and more. Although some of the shops and the weather have seasonal variations, the Tourist Information Office is open every day of the year, apart from Christmas Day. Helpful staff will show you what you can do around Exmoor, out towards Barnstable, even at times heading out to Lundy Island with discounts for National Trust members. It's a thriving community, with winding streets, traditional boutique shops, pedestrians wandering occasionally everywhere, and those little extras you wouldn't always expect. Linton has its own 70-seat cinema. A post office. A well-resourced health centre and chemist. A candle makers, a garage, two small supermarkets and Lynn Valley Art and Craft Centre that brings together the best of local craft, jewellery and gifts, many sourced from the local area, from a community that knows it's in the most idyllic place. And linking Linton and Lynmouth, a rather special cliff railway 
opened in 1890 and in service ever since. A 500-foot descent, or ascent, with breathtaking views in a railway powered only by water. Close to Castle Heights, it's an easy way to nip down to Lynmouth and back up, unless you'd like to walk. Lynmouth itself comes into its own in the summer months, with ice creams, cafes, gift shops, seaside paraphernalia and surfing, all set in the beautiful surroundings of the Exmoor National Park, with development carefully controlled by the park authority. There's even a power of water visitor attraction at the Glenlyn Gorge, generating hydroelectricity. Two miles from Castle Heights, you can visit Lee Bay, a privately owned beach but open to the public, immediately the other side of the Valley of Rocks. And at the bottom of the hill, and famously recommended by the Egon Rone guide, Lee Cottage serves real Devon cream teas, as well as fair trade gifts and souvenirs. Open during the spring and summer, but not Sundays or Mondays apart from bank holidays. And then back to Castle Heights. The summer house again enjoying spectacular scenery in a unique location in one of Britain's national parks. Castle Heights is available all through the year for you to enjoy as part of a short break or longer holiday, offering dramatic views, a comfortable stay and memories to take away of this little bit of heaven we call Devon.